Tiger Tutorials. Today's tutorial is part of the University of Waterloo Computer Science Circles uh, Section 7B Math and it's the very last problem uh, gravity, coding exercise gravity and once again this was a special request uh, anyways here it is uh, the main concerns of this tutorial that I see are handling obviously the uh, PEMDAS correctly uh, that's interesting actually I just saw that a little hover over anyways uh, to the tutorial so first we want to import the math library and we have the variable V and uh, that's obviously this variable in here and uh, we're gonna for, I'll actually I'm gonna first do this I'm gonna say we're gonna take input but then when we want to use this input this is in string and we can't do uh, arithmetic with strings or unless we want to concatenate them so we have to convert the string into a integer but in this case we want it into a float meaning it's going to be a decimal number uh, that is something that I don't think they really mention in here but when I when I ran the program I originally put it into integer and I had an error and it turns out float is what you want to put it into and this is only a three line program and it's going to be uh, printing out obviously the value to whatever this is so uh, let's start off with uh, this V minus so actually I'm just gonna build the basic structure here so we have this 2 times negative 4.9 and then we have this up here. This is going to be divided by these two parentheses items and note that these parentheses are very important. So 2 times negative 4.9 that represents this uh, down below. In the upper side here we're going to do V minus and then we're going to use math library function SQRT for square root and square root is going to have an entire uh, piece of arithmetic underneath its, uh, uh, I'm not sure what to technically call it, but under its, its operand or oper, I don't know what it is. Anyways, so uh, it's, it, the item is going to be V times times, which means raise to uh, 2, so V to the second, second power. Remember this is all being squ uh, square rooted. Uh, minus and uh, what we want to do is we want to first do 4 times negative 4.9 and then times 11,000. So in order to do that we, we use the parentheses and we do 4 times negative 4.9 and then we want to put more parentheses around here because now that we've gotten rid of this piece right here now we want to multiply it by this 11,000 before we subtract it from the v squared to the second power. So now we do parentheses right there, and we already have our parentheses there, times 11,000. Notice there is no comma right there, incorrect. And uh, that looks like a complete and uh, total, I think I'm actually missing a parenthesis here somewhere. Uh, maybe not. That parenthesis goes there. That one's there. Alright, I'll run it and see if I come into an error. Okay, so it turns out we need an extra parenthesis right here. Okay, so the tutorial was a little glitchy in that last piece there because we needed the extra parenthesis. But if you, it, uh, it looks like University of Waterloo system is actually very nice because it shows you a little, it shows the uh, highlighted parentheses so you don't mix them up. Uh, and uh, we come down here and it inputs uh, 1.0, which can be cast to an integer of 1. But I think they want that accuracy uh, aspect here. Program gave the output good, good, good. Anyway, so that's uh, this tutorial. Please visit tiredtutorials.com. Thank you very much.